the outside of your right ankle. The left hand, where is the low? Extra good on the seat. Yeah. Thighs moving back. Widen the thighs. Widen both thighs back, especially the left thigh. Keep moving it back. Shoulder blade is strong. Keep lifted. And then twist. Look under your armpit. Twist. Strong. Deep from the back. Yes. Look up under your armpit. Open your heart to the sky, your chest to the sky. Great. And come back. Down dog. And bring your left hand on the outside of your, no, your right hand on the outside of your left ankle. Keep the thighs, the, the legs strong. Keep the action of the legs strong. Widen the thighs to the back. Nice work. And as the back leg does, it twist and you look up. Yes, twist and you look up. And we enter this place of freedom. And come back to the center. And come to sit in for Matyendrasana. Keep the left foot bent and the right foot on the other side. And open the foot so that we have the sense of both six points on the floor. Yeah. Good. And even here, before we come to a twist, we take the foundation, energize the foot, even the left foot, keep the left foot energized, the four points of the foot energized. Here, this sense of connection, the shins, they come in to connect us. And here, we bring the thighs back. And the, the pelvis widens, and the lower back widens. Scoop the tail from the floor, lengthen up. And from the back, bring the arms up to the sky. Keep the openness of the back. Keep the organs moving back. And then twist towards the right. Left, right arm behind you, and left arm to the outside. If you can, you can hold the, left, the right foot with your left arm. Yes. And keep the action of, I'm hugging in. I'm opening the thighs to the back. I'm lengthening and from the back of the twist. Where we twist and we look back as if we're looking at a mirror and we're smiling to our beautiful self. Mm -hmm. And we're smiling to the whole world. There is a place for beauty and goodness. With the next breath, we forward and relax. And then the sits bones grounding, the pelvis grounding, and we energize the feet, we energize both feet, hugging powerfully with both shins. So you have the sense of the lower shin. The lower shin is kind of like, as I said, like it's lifting. It's lifting up with the foot is so energized and the shins are hugging into the middle. Good. Now the thighs moving back. Yes, thigh bones moving back. The how this widens, there is a nice curve on the lower spine. And from there we scoop, we ground, we lengthen up. From the earth, the connection rises up through the spine, up through the torso, all the way up, lengthening. The back body, fill up the back body, move the, into the back body, and then twist to the left. And you can grab hold of your foot. Or just leave your arm for support. From the back, we twist. Fill up the kidneys. Get taller. The thighs open to the back, and they they open us. They support us in that connection. The breath opens and it flows effortlessly. Bring the ears a little further back, and then keep looking into the back, looking into this. New moment of our life. Allow the breath to flow in freely, even here, in our entire chest and our entire back. The next breath, we look forward and bring the feet together and forward for the mega pose. Yeah, and, and even further away. 